Hey, what's up, everyone? It's TK here. TK or the you see the titles. You already know what time it is. But because before we get into the next season that's approaching us fast, Hell's Paradise, highly recommend it. And Heavenly, Heavenly Delusion, aka Tengoku Daimakyo, heavily recommended. These are my two recommended animes. For the spring season of 2023. If you watched my video in the past. Sorry about the shitty quality. I don't know what happened with whatever I was using. But we did it now. I already did a sound check. I'm using my PS5 controller. That don't sound crisp. Don't, don't it? But anyways. Let's move on to the new season that's approaching. And I am pretty excited. Because I know two that's coming. Because I saw a peak of it. I actually was going to do a video on camera just to show y'all, but I'm going to reference. I'm going to reference a video to y'all to show that I'm not no capper, I'm not no bandwagoner, I'm not no fake motherfucker. Because I like to keep it real. Um, One of the highest in the seasons, we're going to jump right into it. Summer 2023, you already know. Um, so, summer 2023 anime seasons is going to be starting in July. By the way. My birthday coming up. Y'all want to slide something in my cash shop? Check out the description. Just saying. But anyways. Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2. We already know that you're going to be fire. Wait. Is this what I think it is? Holy. Wait. Uh, no, this can't be what I think it is. Wait. Why does it say it's part 2? Wait. That's Wait. That whole season was season 1? Dang. I didn't know that. That whole season from the last time was season one. This is going to say season two. Okay. Oh, this is another one. Another hot one. Jobless Reincarnation. I swore it had like two seasons already. Let me jump over to tab of that. So that's two already. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I'm, I'm, this is legit shock. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Matter of fact, I'm talking about my camera. Being on camera. My bad. Y'all finna see a shitty quality webcam. Let me pull this junk up here. I'm not faking on reactions or whatever, but let me let me put my camera up here. I don't got no fucking light. It's all good though. We finna we finna make some makeshift adjustments on the spot. On the spot. I should grab my mangas. Let me see. Let's let's tweak the brightness up. There we go. Y'all see my ass? Use my door sense. Uh. But I was not expecting no goddamn jobless reincarnation to be on this list, to be real. Oh, damn it. Mobius. Uh, put it right there. Boom. Uh, what's this? They got something that's being highlighted in the background. All right. Put my ass right here. Fucking peasants. Let me stop. Let me stop being so mean. Not in the best mood today, to, to be honest, y'all. Not in the best mood, but uh, let me pop this up. Why not? A little promo. That's a cash out. You want to slide me something for my birthday? My birthday June thirtieth. Don't have to. I'm just I'm just promoting it. Why not? Want to get a little support? But anyways, I'm surprised. This goddamn Masamune Revenge. Yo, I was so excited for this goddamn anime, but this shit left me heavenly, heavenly disappointed. Oh, so pretty much. Let me tell y'all. I'm not. I'm not even gonna watch this. Wait, is this a? Is this an OVA or this is actual season? Oh, it's actually a different season. Should I give it a? Should I try to let them redeem themselves? Cause this junk dropped hell of a years ago from what I remember. Let me bring up a tab right now. Let me see. Can they redeem themselves? Cause I was looking forward to this anime. It was starting off pretty damn good, and it left me disappointed. I was so. Yo, I was so disappointed in this anime. Let's see what year this thing came out. This thing came out. I still gave it a seven. Oh, I think I need to drop that shit. This came out 2017. Yeah, we dropping that score. Cause I didn't like how that shit ended. I, don't, I probably forgot to update it. We gonna get that shit up fine. But that jump left me really disappointed. Uh... I'm going to give it a chance. I'm going to give it a chance. 
if I talk right now, I'm going to spoil some things, but it was stupid. And I, I guess the pacing was pretty crappy because I didn't like what was going on. And I didn't like how it ended. I definitely like how it ended. Uh, Bleach, the second season of the uh, Return of Bleach. You know, that's going to be a hot one. I don't got to say it. But I'm not a Bleach fan. I don't have nothing against Bleach. I'm not no bandwagon. I'm not no fake person that, like, I know anything about Bleach. I don't know nothing about Bleach. When I would watch Toonami uh, as a youngin, I would see it on. And every time I would see it on, it would be at the end of an episode. And it would always be at a, like, it had to be towards the end or the middle of some crazy-ass action. I'm seeing people standing in the air, fighting, running running in the air. I'm like, what the hell's going on? And I didn't, I never got into it. I never got to see it from the beginning. Oh, my Hori Mia. We got a second season for that? Or is this a, okay, it might not be a second season. Okay. Well, I'll still check it out. That was a pretty nice, sweet, a uh, little slice of life anime. Give me a moment. Let me pause this real quick. Let me grab my collection. Let me show y'all. And by the way, I'm going to refer y'all to a video that I did like last year when I showed these mangas off. Be right back. Now, if your ass watched my video, I can refer it. You can check the time. You can check the date. I was showing off some of my mangas of this ZOM 100. ZOM 100 now has an anime. I'm kind of hyped. Uh, they announced a live action, which I was going to ignore because I did not want to watch no live action of a manga that I've been reading that I haven't even finished uh, reading through because not completed. Uh, so Zone 100, it has an anime adaptation. You see, already marked it as read. I'm definitely finna check this shit out. See how it goes. That's not finna be hot. It's about to be fire. Hold on, though. Huh. Let me go back to this real quick. Could have got this bright ass background so I could use it to capitalize for my lighting. You see this? This is like heavy as hell. I have all the current mangas of volumes except for I think one literally just came out. One literally just came out recently. Volume one, volume two, volume three, volume four. Volume five, you see, I'm on my, I'm on my manga shit. I ain't no, no fake, uh, bandwagon or whatever you want to call it. Volume six, right? Yep. Volume seven. Volume eight. Volume nine. I ain't read volume nine yet. I just got volume nine. I just got these two volumes like a month ago. I, I read this one. I ain't read this one yet. I gotta get volume ten. So I got nine of the volumes. For that Zom 100, I'll be right back. Let me put this away real quick so I get more comfy. Yeah. So, when I say I'm excited for this Zom 100, you already know I'm a fan of it. Because I was already, I was already got them reading it. Matter of fact, I don't got to refer y'all. I don't got to refer y'all to the, uh, to the video. Let me, let me, let me bring my YouTube right now. Let me bring the YouTube right now. By the way. Where the fuck my views at from my, my Baruto review? Where are all the real people at? I get the realest review ever. It was kind of everywhere. I had to. It was so many that damn moments on there. Uh, but let me let me scroll it down. Let me let me scroll through the timeline. I got some playthroughs. All right, let me just go through all my videos. Let's eight months ago. This is when I returned to YouTube. So eight months ago. I was, I was like, I was showing off my manga collection eight months ago. And I showed off the manga, the Zone 100 books, the ones I had currently at that time that was out. It was only probably like four or five books at the moment, I don't know. But anyways, so I'm definitely hyped for it. Hopefully it lived up to my expectations. Hopefully it's good as the manga. But yeah, so this, this summer season is pretty fire right now. Pretty fire. I don't know what this is. I never watched it. Uh, I still never got into this yet. I was planning to watch this eventually, but I never got around to watching it yet. Maybe sometime down the line, I'll check it out, but still haven't gotten into the Stray Dogs uh, manga. Not sure what this is about. It's a comedy. Let me see. Uh, let's see. She always has attention fixed on her. Okay, so she's a cute character. 
blah 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 blah. I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I had to drop this shit. Uh, there was part timer two season two. I'm pretty sure. There's no part part time, right? I don't know why I said season. It has to be a season two part two because they made a season two recently, and I watched almost all of it, and then I got bored of it, and I dropped it. So never had a season four. There was a part timer. Uh, Shingami. Second season of Shigami. Okay, something made. I don't think I watched the anime before. So I'm not even going to acknowledge it. Uh, Watashi no Shiwasi no Ketakon. I probably bought it. Child of a loveless arranged marriage. After her mother died, her father bought, brought, in his, brought in his lover of her own daughter. Hold on. Let's click on it real quick. After years of being treated like dirt, he has learned to keep her head down, hide her pain. What genre is this? I feel like if she just watched the trailer, I, ain't, I don't got no sound. Kind of using my dual sense, not my headphones over there. But let's check out this little teaser real quick. Let's see. Seem like it might be a depressing slice of life. Maybe romance type anime. Guess it's something about arranged marriage, right? I don't feel like reading all through it. I'm sorry, y'all. Uh, I might give it a try. It's just not looking appealing to me right now. And I'm not. I haven't been watching that many romance animes like that in a while. Uh, we got Roni Kenshin return and Amanda got the Roni Kenshin I'm going like I'm a fan of it. I'm not I never really seen it. So I'm not gonna pretend like I am. But it might be hot. It's probably gonna be hot for those who who bandwagon in it and people who actually truly do like Roni Kenshin. We got manga called Liar Liar. Mm, let me see what this liar liar is about. Liar, liar. At the Academy Island, everything is settled through games. Wait for a certain number of stars. With the strongest student being granted ranking of being granted the ranking of seven stars, the transfer student unexpectedly beats the strongest and the strongest empress and becomes the strongest in the school. Mind game of buffing games. Uh that's about reading it. I don't think I'm gonna watch it. Let's zoom up a little bit. What quality they gave me? They gave me a regular ass quality. Come on now. But they say the the main he ended up being the, one of the strongest people. Why they look so cutie cutie? I need I need a little more of a mature look. And they they just gave me all visual novel looking things. I'll check it out, but I'm not gonna say I'm I'm looking forward to it. They gave me visual novel visuals for it. It's an etchy though, so a lot of people who are into the etchy, you might like it. Uh, this name looked kind of familiar. This don't look familiar. Uh, but let me see. My senpai from work is tiny and cute. That's a skip. I don't like I don't like those titles like that. Those animes usually don't get my attention. Check your Apple Fairy Tales season two. We're gonna go back to this. I just wanna see what else there is. I could just ignore them. Uh this reincarnated some other world, blah 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 blah. Is this a slime thing? Or this is something else? Uh we're skipping it. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm not a little big ass fan of Isakai's. I have seen a good amount of Isakai's that did it very well. But ones with these titles and the ones like I'm the strongest person in the world. Oh, I'm maxing out my defense. Blah 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 blah. I'm not interested in those. I'm sorry. Jobless reincarnation is fire though. It's very few now that that comes out that I still will give a chance. Here you go. Recar another world. We have promised to cheat with the cheat power. It's one thing, but to reborn as a baby and then left for dead after your royal parents think you're powerless is another thing. Oh my. Goodness, what's up with all these goddamn? It's so many goddamn isekais. The anime market is overflowed with isekais. It's so goddamn much of them. I watched from I watched one like a season ago. It was actually decent, not all that, but it was decent. But there's so many goddamn isekais. Like, 
I'm sorry, I, they got to slow it down with these goddamn e guys. I can't get jiggy with all of them. Oh, we got the guy that's looking all cutie cute or whatever. This one might be decent. Let me see if this baby just kills this wolf, then I don't know. Uh, see, they got some overpowered shit happening. You know what? This one looks a little decent. I ain't gonna lie, it's looking a little decent. Look at it a little decent. Let me add it to the list. I'm gonna add this. This 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 probably gonna be a hot one. Am I actually the strongest? Oh my goodness, the English titles is the strongest shit. Oh my goodness. I might have to remove it off my list now. <laughs> Alright, but this one looks familiar. I think I might have seen a manga for it, maybe. Classroom for Heroes is the English name. EU Kori Koro Shitsu. Shitsu. A uh, long time ago, there existed a demon lord who terrorized throughout the world until hero stepped up to challenge him. This is another reincarnation junk. Okay, let's let's check out this check out this little thing real quick. Actually, yeah, I might hear the sound. I don't know if you're hearing the sound. Hopefully, you two don't fucking block my video. Cause like I said, I'm not. I'm I don't got my headphones hooked up to my dual sense. So, okay, he's looking like a happy, joy, jolly character. I can't hear his freaking voice, though. Hopefully, it turns out to be good. Hopefully, it can hold my attention. Just a lot. Yeah, it's been certain animes that I think it's going to be good. And then I watch it for a while. Then, as it get a little bit deeper in, I it lose my attention. We'll add to the list. We'll add to the list. Bam. Okay. Uh, Royal Pride, Finally Boss, Scrum, and this Otome game. Let's see. Dark Gathering. This is a manga for this Dark Gathering. I've been seeing Viz tweet out, uh, tweet out the mangas. So I'll check out the anime. Actually, it's a, it's a manga for this too. I literally saw them tweeting out a manga for this too a while back. It's like probably four out total right now, maybe. Then we got this. This is based off the video game, Ul Ulterior. We probably gonna check out the heck. We got some we're going to check out. And we got some that I know it's going to be hot right off the jump. We got something called Temple. Let's pull up a tap for that. We got hella taps. Pull it up. Uh... I think I might have saw a little bit of the first one of this before, but I dropped it. Mm, let's pull up a tab for it. Something about some spy, but nope. I ain't fucking with it. We're going to stay with my spy family, which is actually returning this fall, I believe. Something about the idol. Uh... Almost all the heroes of race got killed or something like that. We could bring up a tab for it. I'm just skimming through it. I don't read all the synopsis. The synopsis always tell a little bit too much. So I don't try to read everything. Uh, see, this one is missing the etchy tag. We're going to pull up a tab for it just to read up on it. Uh, what movies he got? Well, are these movies or these are just uh, things that's dropping automatically on the one thing? Yeah. Um... Baki, that's probably going to drop on Netflix all in one day. Uh, whatever this is, I saw this on Netflix too. But I mean, I ain't watched these, but I, I've seen it up on Netflix. Uh, another one, Bastard, I've seen it on Netflix. I didn't. I think I actually tried to watch Bastard. I think I saw like one episode of Bastard. Um, Deadly Sins, I pretty much think that's what this is. But I've been stopped watching Deadly Sins after the first season. I didn't like the main character. Uh, this has like a video game, I believe. But okay, just got some OVA. I guess it's an anime series originally. We got some movies. Uh, third year middle school student lives in town. The exit has been sealed off due to an explosion. Mm. Might be good. Might be good. 
We got some Resident Evil stuff. Whatever this is, Sand Blam. Wait, did I just see? Did I just read something right? Or um, I feel like I read something that was not okay. Job for that. I don't care about no Crayon Chan or whatever the hell his name is. I never got to that series. Fate Stay got a special. Okay. Hello Taps. Hello Taps. By the way, let me let me let's let's do a little recap. Alright, so the uh, Akayashi Triangle is gonna be actually rebooted. I think it's be a rebooted this summer, actually. So it went up to seven episodes and then it stopped. It stopped like two two times. So they're gonna reboot. They're gonna re-air episodes and finish it off. I think this season. I think this season coming. Uh, Death Mount Play. I've been watching that. Eden Zero season two. Been watching that. Hills Paradise one of the ones I recommended. Been watching that. Uh, this is the Marsh. This this is the magic and over muscle thing with the main character. He don't got no magic, but he uses muscle to trick people and overpower the magic people. Uh, actually. I'm kind of close. I was going to drop it, but since it's only like, what, four episodes left, I guess, I'm gonna, or three episodes left, I'm going to watch it, finish it through, but I don't, I don't, I don't plan on to return to this. Uh, My Home Hero, Fire, two episodes left. This one is kind of a letdown, it ain't as how good I thought it was going to be, but uh, we're going to pull through and see how it ends up in Heavenly Delusion, which I told y'all about. Like I said, Hell's Paradise, which is, this is a Japanese name here, Hell's Paradise. And Heavily Delusion, that's the Japanese name right there. Tengoku Daimakiyu. I recommend those two from the spring season. Vinland Saga, been fire. It's been going on strong. It's going to wrap up pretty soon. Uh, and that, that, that's been going on since the other season, actually. But that's what I've been watching. Let me close this off now. I got made some placement. So. There goes on 100. Or more. This is like some short stories things. So that okay. That we haven't lived this one another way. A normal high school student reincarnates into an eight year old body. Oh my god damn god. Another reincarnation one. Too many goddamn is reincarnation isekai is where it's called. Okay, let's, let's see what's happening here. Again, hopefully it's not picking up. It might be picking up my my desktop audio, so I'm gonna skip through if music is playing. <laughs> Maybe I'll give it a chance, but like I said, to me, Isakai's is not my thing, and I usually lose interest in it. Um, this, like I said, this has a manga for it. I think it's like three books out total right now at the moment of me recording this, which is just June the fifth right now. But this has a manga's out for it already. They actually say this is like a horror. Let me read the, the synopsis. Uh, a college freshman who hates ghosts. Unlucky for him, he has a knack for attracting spirits. Two years ago, connection from when receiving it. Spiritual energy on his hand. Okay. As part of connection, he takes part of a part job as a tutor. His pupil, probably by. She's a child of prodigy. Um, just as long as I'm not saying it's not, not, not telling me too much, but I will give it a watch. I'll give it a watch. If y'all read the manga, y'all already know what to expect from it. Helk. Or Helic. Um... Yeah, this is something about some demon. Yeah, that's why I didn't get it. I was thinking about getting one of these mangas when I saw it. It had an interesting cover. Human seven faces of the demon lord, the hands of a lone hero, and denizens of a demon were prepared for a contest to determine the side who inherited. Oh, yeah. Who's going to inherit the title of a demon king? Okay. Some little tournament thing. Let's just check it out. Before I wrap this up, hopefully I got enough memory on my computer. We got 24 minutes in. Okay, let's see, let's see. Check out for me. This little teaser. Just the main character. Hello guys, my name is Hulk. I want to be Hercules. Let me stop. It actually might be decent. It might be decent. Guys, okay, we got some hand-to-hand -hand combat. <laughs> 
I'll add onto my list. It starts July 12th. And playing the watch. Bam. Temple. Um was always told by his father that no one could live alone, but he is determined Ether and his father wasn't sh wasn't seen with, with the best intentions. Okay, so this is gonna be some type of heroin type anime metro. There you go. Someone on Metro he loves these heroes and that cheese stuff. I mean, I'll give it a try, but heroes don't hold my attention much, to be honest. I mean, I used to watch them when I was a little bit, a little bit younger, but they don't hold my attention that much. Uh, but I'll check it out. I'll check it out when I see it on the feeds. The Gene of I, or AI. Science fiction. Uh, I don't know from the box they got the name. And boom, and boom, I don't know if it... Anyways. The doctor who treats, wait, this is it treats, right? Treats robot and humanoid problems takes place in the near future when humanoids with artificial intelligence to account for it. 10% of the population, the main character, Dr. Hikaru, Hikari. Oh, it's also of a cover name. Okay, uh, what is he trying to do? His humanoid wife with a computer virus. Literally, back a little later, blah, 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 blah. Let me see how y'all teaser thing looking like. You want to do? I'm just trying to make a dialogue for it. All right, I like the art, the art style. Oh, we got someone getting punched in the face. Okay. Okay, okay, we got some more fights going on. Okay, we got some drama spilling where's the where's this title i mean the, the categories drama sci-fi suspense uh in a psychological go on add it to the list add it to the list bam i think you about through with it this is the one that's like almost human race is wiped out is this a mech one yep it's a mech one i'm sorry I don't want to be like discrimination, but it's not that many mech animes I have watched that I liked. I think it was like one I saw recently that was decent to me. I'm not adding so much onto my list, but I'll give it a check. I'll give it. I'll check it out, but I can't say I'm gonna really be in there like that watching it. Uh, two years ago. The hero Max defeated the Demon Lord in order to gain the power of the Demon Lord. Yeah, oh my goodness. So this girl, the Demon Lord, I'm guessing. Yep, she got some things popping on her head. Uh, we ain't gonna add to my list. We're gonna skip that. But this movie, looks like it might have some potential. And Sandland. The entire Earth. The war destroyed the entire Earth, leaving a barren wasteland with the supply of water is controlled by a greedy king. In search of a long lost lake, Chef Ryo asked the king demons for help and got the king's son, Bezobo. I can't pronounce the name, but his ass is not Persona. Well, this demon, the demon itself, the name is in Persona. That's how I think. But, anyways, this, let me see a little something. It looks nice. It looks like a, a Kiryu Tabiyama. How you, that's the name The dude with the main Dragon Ball. That's how this, this is looking like. I'm pretty sure it is him. <laughs> and we got the little 3D looking art style. Yeah. It's definitely by a dude that did Dragon Ball. Yeah, so we had that to the list too. This is a movie, by the way. This is a movie, right? I'm pretty sure this is a movie. Yeah, it's a movie. So we're going we gonna to watch that. That looks little fire. And that says August is supposed to come out. They showed it so early. Okay. Uh, all right. So let's go ahead and recap it. The hottest anime for that summer, twenty twenty three. The Jujutsu Kaisen season two. You already know we there day one. Jobless reincarnation. I can't believe this is actually the second season. Holy, the first season was must have had like twenty some episodes. But we we here for it. We here for it. Day one. Masamune Kun's Revenge. We finna give this junk. Oh, bag it up. My dog is trying to, he trying to come up in my face. 
we're gonna give this a second shot. Let's see can they redeem themselves after that shitty ending. Is my dog in the camera now? Yep, he's in the camera now. Um this one uh, is just uh, a alright, alright, back it back it up, back it up, five five pap you five, pap. That's what I call it pal. Anyways, Hori Mia got some little uh stories from the manga that was in the main anime, okay. Zone 100, you saw my collection, you know my anticipation and my hype for this is real. Hopefully it lives up to the standards. Uh, we got this movie that's coming out sometime soon that I'm going to... I'm going to put good faith in and hope it's a good one. Just by what I read. Uh, hoping this one is a decent one. This is just... This is... Alright. Hold on. Hold on, let's back it up. Jujutsu Kaisen. Jobless Recarnation. Masamune Re Return. I mean, Rasmune's Revenge. Uh, oh crap! I just deleted it. But Zom One Hundred. That's the, that's the last one. Those are the hottest ones for the season. Now the ones I'm looking forward to and hope it's gonna live up to the hype and be good. I mean, not live up to the hype, but ones I'm expect. I'm hoping to be a good gem. This one, the Gene of AI or I. My expectations for this one are not too high. I'm just gonna give it a check out. Let me check it out because I was interested in it when I saw the manga. Uh, this one might be a hot one because a lot of y'all like these isekais. I'm going to give it a try. I can't guarantee I'm going to stick through the whole ride. Oh, yeah, and we got this one. This one seems like it, had, it might have some potential. Hopefully, it is a good one. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, hottest anime in the season. Hottest anime in the season, y'all. You can see my some of my manga updates. You can see the mangas I read in here too. Once you have my page, y'all, you see the mangas I read in. Uh, but yeah, we finna be wrapping it up. Hold on. Plan to watch. You see all my plan to watches right here. I post most of them. I'm waiting for that Goblin Slayer. I'm waiting for that Fairy Tale and the Hundred Year Quest. I was gonna get the manga, but I saw the anime was announced, so I didn't get it. I'm ready for the, the return of this, the season two of that. Tokyo Revengers. We gotta get that. We gotta get the fairy tale, you know. But yeah, most of oh, the Baruto, we gotta get the Baruto return. We gotta get the Black Clover return. I think that's a movie, though. Yeah, that's a movie. But yeah. Y'all yeah, see the hottest in the seasons, right? This is gonna be a hot one, too, but this is a movie. But boom, boom, boom. Boom. Those are the highest in the seasons. Then we got the ones that I'm interested in checking out. Uh, that's a movie. I'm going to check it out. I think that's going to be good. Yeah. Anyways, y'all. TK here. TK Redori's car. Final Fantasy 16 is coming soon. That's what I'm going to be gaming on this, this June 22nd. That Final Fantasy. But, uh, yeah, not sure next time I'll be back with a video. Not sure, not really sure. But, uh, I don't, I don't really be in moves to do, like, anime reviews and stuff like that. So, uh, y'all see me when y'all see me. Oh, yeah, Zom, no, Zom 100. Zom 100 definitely get an anime review for the spring animes. That's definitely getting a review. But any other anime, I can't. Guarantee reviews for it. It's 100 though because I read the manga material. So that's going to get a review. Anyways, y'all, it's TK, TRDS. Thanks for tuning in. Till next time. Peace. And bow.